Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Now this is a video I've been thinking about filming for a while and I don't actually really know what to call it. Um, basically it is a mini gift guide of things that I have seen this year and have thought about getting for people for gifts for when they've got absolutely everything in their lives and I wanted to encourage this year uh, the people that I was giving gifts to to be a little bit more friendly to their environment and sustain their be a bit more sustainable within their lifestyle choices so these are the gifts that I thought would be cool and I thought I'd share them with you that's it basically <laughs> Okay, so the first thing that I wanted to talk about was soap dishes. I know that sounds really old granny, but there are some amazing, beautiful dishes out there you can get now. This one is just basically made of marble and it works as a platter. So you can put like a couple of different kind of gourmet style soaps on it. Um, for me, I usually have like a couple in my bathroom. So I'll have like a big, like full size soap from Lush and a couple of samples so when my guests come round they can try different ones. I don't use plastic bottled hand wash with like a pump or anything because obviously plastic has to be recycled and yeah I much prefer like the naked way and it looks gorgeous too. Talking about naked products, um, Lush is a really great company as an example but there are so many more companies out there that do bath bombs, soaps, shower gels, shampoo bars. There are loads and loads on the indie market as well as mainstream. So I definitely recommend going naked this year for your Christmas presents rather than buying things that are in plastic bottles. This for example is a bubble bar from Lush and it's so cute um, but you're not going to have any packaging once you've finished with it. So no we need to recycle or throw anything in the bin. Um, the footprint that it's going to leave behind is minimal. Okay, so next let's talk about food and drink, especially drink. So I love tea and coffee and recently I did a video and review of a company called Turtle Tea. I'll link them above. Turtle Tea are amazing. They are just so thought provoking and really inspired me when I was making this, about making this video and thinking about your day-to-day -day lifestyle choices. Um, tea subscription, absolutely fantastic. Something very, very different, really affordable. And you could sign up for maybe two to three months and someone's gonna get some really amazing flavored teas that not only are plastic free, but taste good too. Okay, so now moving on to coffee, which is one of my other favorite things. Um, so this is a clap cup by Stojo. Um, now there are different versions of this online, you can go onto their website and see different ones. There's also dupes of this, um, if you go onto eBay you can pick them up for two to three pounds, but this is such an amazing cup. I really wanted to share it with you in a video because I thought it was really cool, especially if you are like me, don't want a huge cup in your handbag taking up loads of room. I absolutely love the idea of going out and grabbing a coffee. I hate having to throw the paper cup away at the end and know that it's not going to be recycled. So having a like travel mug in your bag is a really great idea. What I love about this one specifically is that it folds down and it folds down to five centimeters. So I'm just going to show you how it works because I just think it is a really great product. Um, okay, so here's the cup. Basically what you're going to do is take the plastic little dishy thing off and then you're going to kind of squeeze this bit inside here. Okay, like that. And then this bit here is going to sit and you're going to push that underneath through there and that is your cup. I mean, that is way smaller than any other cup I have ever seen. What a fantastic idea. Once you've finished with it, you can fold it up, take it home, wash it, put it back in your bag, and you're ready to go again. Um, I just think this is the best cup I have ever seen, literally. I love it. I think it's a great idea. 
um, and you use the plastic bit obviously just to protect your hands with hot drinks um, I haven't tried it in all the coffee shop shops yet to make sure people are happy to use it but I just think it's so clever definitely worth an honorable mention so the next okay so the next item that I'm going to be talking about are seeds I love the idea of growing fresh herbs in my kitchen. This year I grew basil throughout the summer and it was just gorgeous being able to mix that in with pasta and tomatoes and it was just added so much extra flavour to my food. It wasn't something that I would have normally done. Um, earth costs nothing so you know go up in your garden, dig out some earth, you can get some little pots down at Poundland or Pound Stretchers put some seeds in and yeah make somebody a beautiful herb garden or give them a herb garden for their kitchen it's a great gift okay so the next item is something I actually heard about on Dragon's Den and thought it was very very interesting watched a couple of videos about how they worked and thought do you know what this is a really good idea I hate using cling film cling film is the most annoying thing in the world so I got some and these are beeswax wraps. So basically they are cotton that is dipped in beeswax and basically provides a hygienic seal for your food products. So you can use these in the kitchen, they are completely reusable. These ones are made by an indie company called Planet Warrior and I've got a discount code for you here. So if you're interested in picking some of these up, you can do. So the one that I picked up is quite big um it's like a giant big massive piece um you can get smaller ones round ones all different shapes and sizes um personally i thought going for the bigger one would be better because i can cut it up into smaller pieces you can also use it to wrap your sandwiches and pat in your pat lunch box and once you're finished with it you just run it under cold water to clean it let it dry and you can use it again and again and again Okay, and the last but not least, talking about pat lunch um, lunches, is a pat lunch box. A really simple, affordable thing to do. Give somebody the gift of making them a pat lunch every day for work. Um, so that is what I'm planning this year. Um, I did it, tried to do it last year and failed. So I'm gonna have another go again this year. Um, and yeah, picking up one of these. These are a pound from Poundland and you know, it saves my other half having to buy lots of sandwiches throughout the day. He can have homemade sandwiches in a box that we reuse. It's no brainer really. Um, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this mini gift guide video. Let me know your thoughts on the products that I'm talking about and if you've got any really amazing tips tricks and ideas of things that make your life a little bit more sustainable on a daily basis and think would make great gifts for somebody this Christmas pop them below because I'm really interested in exploring that side of lifestyle and thinking about how we can reduce our footprint so yeah um, leave a comment uh, and that's everything for me guys I hope you're all planning and wrapping as we speak for your Christmas holiday uh, gift and presents for people and yeah I'll see you all once you've unwrapped yours. Take care guys. Bye!